I got my impressions. Vanity mirror is mine. I pay for it. It's mine. I pay for it. I'm about to look like a boss. Hey guys, it's Ashley Lowe here and in today's video I'm going to be talking about my Vanity Impressions mirror and I'm so freaking excited because this is something that I've been wanting for a very, very long time. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and let's get right on into this video. So the first thing I want to talk about is the shipping. It took me roughly around a week to receive my mirror. I purchased it on the 9th and I received it today, which is the 17th. But then after a few days, I hadn't received anything from the seller. I didn't receive any like shipping details, information. There was nothing. There wasn't a tracking number. And I knew like to be patient just because of everything that's going on. I don't know if you guys are like me, but if you are like me, when you order something online and you press that confirm button and you send those people your money, you want your stuff pronto. It's that. That did worry me a little bit, so I did go ahead and contact the seller. Just sent them a nice email and was like, have you received it? Have you confirmed it? Is it on the way? My money and I want it now. That's how I felt. So that's what was said. Irma got back to me in a reasonable amount of time and she was very nice about it. And she told me, you know, no worries. I'm who you're going to be keeping in contact with now. We'll get that out to you as soon as possible. Uh, so within a few hours, I think that same day, I got my tracking number. Yes, I did. I got my tracking number and then it came. So that was on the 13th and then it came on the 17th. Again, if you're having issues with the tracking information or wondering where your package is, make sure that before you go into a frenzy that you just contact the seller, send a quick email, call them if they have a phone number. I did not receive a response when I called, but the email did work. This mirror was $456.94. However, I was able to get this mirror for $414.92. And the only reason I was able to do that was because of this app that I use, which is called Honey, and they always have discounts on pretty much anything that you need. So I purchased the Hollywood Glow Plus Vanity Mirror and it is the glossy white with frosted LED glow bulbs and cool white and it's non-Bluetooth. They do have Bluetooth mirrors but after reading the reviews I just didn't really feel like it was worth that investment. My limit was literally, I really wanted to spend 300 just because that was how much my light that I'm using up here costs. And also when I did make this purchase they were having a sale. I don't know if it was like 30% or 40% off. Just continuously look on the site to see if they're having a sale or not. Because, listen, 500 plus dollars for a mirror? <sighs> Man, y'all got it like that. Salute. Let's unbox this bad boy and see if it's worth the hype. Alright, let's go. Let's do it. So it comes with the bulbs. This one already sounds like it's damaged. I'm not using this one because something ain't right. These are a pack of five. And they're wrapped up and secured. Come out! <laughs> it won't come out. I just want it to come out. Tell it to come out. Oh my god. I want to see you. I want to see what you look like. Perfect. Please. What's up, you? Be perfect, please. Let me tell you guys. Impressions Vanity, you guys are thebomb.com. I really love your attention to detail because I love that you guys have your own tape with your brand logo on it. I think that's super dope. Shout out to you for that. Details matter, and I'm out of breath because this is a lot of work. Okay. Okay. This is it right here. This is the big moment. <laughs> Be perfect, please. I'm scared. <sighs> okay. This is the big. 
big old surfboard. Oh my god, this is heavy. This is really heavy. So this is actually what I was worried about. Um, because my desk is so small, and a lot of the videos that I did look at, the surfboard, the surfboard, which is the base, this is so big, and it, on a lot of the videos, it took up a lot of the room, plus the mirror, so I'm hoping and praying that I don't have to use this. Hopefully, I could just prop the mirror on my wall, lean it against there. Impressions, if you're watching this video, please make another base, one that is much thinner, and that can hold it up. Please, I beg of you. It's 2020, it's time for a change. All right, America. That's heavy. Ooh, that's heavy. That's heavy. I don't know how you guys are putting this on your walls. Because this is a heavy hair. Okay. Okay. I don't see a crack or anything. You go over here. Stay, stay away. Okay. Okay. And you. Oh, you're so heavy. Look at you. Alright guys, so here is the mirror. As you can see, there's like no scratches and stuff thus far. See, here's the little outlet. Um, hopefully that works. <laughs> I don't know that it's a crack here. I noticed small fine crack here. Um, hopefully that crack doesn't get bigger, but I will be letting them know. I don't know why they had to draw on that. Like, I don't want that handwriting on my mirror. They could have left that alone. I don't understand that one. So what if I was hanging it high and then someone can see that? That just kind of looks tacky to me. So with the plug is the screws. Um, I'm guessing that this is for the base. A lot of the videos, I didn't notice that people have problems with the bulbs blowing and some of them weren't wearing gloves and they recommend that you use gloves. So. That's what I'm gonna do. This is opening it. So it looks like they're packaged pretty nicely, you know, with it being in a box and then being in here. Um, I really just wish that those two individual ones were wrapped up. I don't know why they wouldn't wrap those up, but what else? I feel kind of sad that I don't have all the light bulbs. Guess it is what it is, you know? It's time for the moment of truth! Ah! I'm scared! <laughs> Nothing. Dimmer. A dimmer. Oh, it comes with a switch and a dimmer on this side. I don't think I showed you guys. But... too much buzzing or anything it's real subtle and as I increased gradually 
it does get louder. Well, it sounds even louder than before. That might be an issue, but I also read um, when I did the research and looked at like the Yelp reviews and stuff, a lot of people said that it's the bulbs and how they were manufactured. So I might just end up just replacing all of the, bul the bulbs. Is it worth $500? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. If my bulbs start popping like popcorn, it's going to be a no for me. But, you know, if these are the only issues that I have so far and it holds up and it lasts for at least five years for $500, then yes, I will say that it is worth it. I just want to see real quick if this outlet works. <coughs> it's about to die anyways. <coughs> and it works. It's charging. It says it's charged. It's a USB port on here too. Let's see if that works. And it's good. USB works. Hold on. Yep. So far, so good. As far as the mirror itself working, I guess the biggest problem would be the light bulbs. Next time you guys see me, I'll be giving you a full room tour. And yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it. Check out Impressions Vanity Mirror if you're interested in buying. Make sure that you catch that sale while you can. Um, I would definitely do my research before I make a big investment and really ask yourself, like, is this something that you really need? Is something that I need? Because <laughs> I like looking at myself and I want to look good. So, if you're like me, maybe, you know, you've been eyeing this for a very long time now and you saved up and you got it. I always say if you can't buy it twice, don't buy it. I'm in that position where I can buy it twice. So, I bought it. And that's just that on that. I don't want to talk about it. Okay. I felt bad after I pressed confirm payment, but I got it. You know, it is it's pretty great. Um, the only thing, of course, is the bulbs and the small little hiccups. This is my impressions, Vanity. Thank you guys for tuning in. Make sure that you catch my next video of my room, makeover, DIYs, and all that great stuff. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. See you guys later.